Hey there, I'm Colin Hopkins, president of Key Renter Salt Lake. Today I wanted to discuss with you all something that has come up quite a few times in some of my conversations uh, with you guys individually. Uh, there have been many headlines talking about house prices, interest rates, but not a lot of talk, talk about the rental stats. Uh, so many of you might be wondering how is how are rental prices versus home prices going up and with all this interest rate and how is it affecting my property? Well, that's exactly what I want to talk to you about along with how this is a huge benefit to all of us. Um, here's the scoop. Renting in Utah is more affordable than it is to buy a house in Utah uh, for your average home buyer. You heard it. You, most people right now in the market could go and find a home for rent in Utah for significantly less than they would be paying for a mortgage on that exact same home. Let's back this statement up with some data. In Salt Lake County, the median home sales price of a single family home was 523,000 in January of 2024. If we take that median sales price on a four bedroom, two bath house, and we put an average 10% down payment down, you'd be looking at a mortgage payment of a whopping $3,500 a month. This also would be the average home out there uh, in Utah. That means it could need some renovating, you might want to be updating it, and it could need some work. Now let's compare that with your average home for rent. Uh, according to the Gardner Institute and policy up at the University of Utah, an average rental home it ranges from about $21 to $2,400. That's a $1,200 to $1,400 uh, premium to be able to buy the same home that you could rent. If that doesn't paint a picture of why it's more affordable to rent than to buy, I don't know what else will. Uh, now, what does that mean for you and I uh, before you and I? As home values go up, more and more people will turn to renting. With an already strong market in with Utah's market, that will just increase the demand for rental properties. As more folks lean towards renting over buying, our properties become more, of, become more of a valuable asset. As we look at the history of Utah, home values, um, the homes and home values will go up and they will be the greatest asset. Since 1970, home values in Utah have gone up on a seven, over seven years, an average of 52%. That's 7.5% annually since 1970. Owning a home in 2024 will be the greatest asset you can have. The gap between home ownership and renting will continue to close as interest rates go come down and rent prices go up. Um, for all of those who own rental properties, that means increased values for their assets and a greater ROI. Um, as we should expect over the next seven years, we should see an additional 52% increase in home values, along with all of the cash flow, the principal pay down that someone else is doing for you, the tax benefits, the depreciation, and so much more. Uh, if you'd like to talk to me more about this, I'd love to sit down and chat with you um, or email me or any other way possible. Um, as always, Key Renter Salt Lake Property Management is here to help serve you as your professional property manager with no surprises. Thanks and have a great day.